Hi guys and welcome back to another video now today what I'm going to be bringing you is season 4 episode 12 of City Signings now just before we get into today's video if you could drop a like on it let's try and go for 40 likes on today's video that would be massively appreciated subscribe if you are new as well I am to hit 5,000 subscribers before the end of the football season so if you could subscribe that would be absolutely class now if you haven't already checked out the two videos I uploaded over the weekend because Bradford didn't play I got back you know more up to date with Austin Samuels and Curtis Guthrie both leaving the club so if you haven't already check them out if you could go over check them out drop a like on it all that sort of stuff show them some, some support because they upload them whilst you know actually in real life football games are being played so it's understandable if some of you guys did miss them videos but if you do want to go check them out they are up on the channel but today we are going to be talking about the fact Bradford City have signed Ruman Burrell I want to say his name is from Middlesbrough on a season long loan he's a striker coming probably as an Austin Samuels replacement you know he's coming in on, on loan as a forward option you know a youngster that's type of player and uh, today we're going to be talking about him he did get announced four days ago he actually got announced before Guthrie departed but I wanted to get rid you know the two videos out where the two strikers depart before I carried on with the signings we also signed a left back Matty Folds I want to say his name is that video will be coming out tomorrow if all things you know go ahead as planned but make sure you leave a like and subscribe let's get on with today's video so on January the 14th at 5pm, Bradford City tweeted saying, Breaking news, we are delighted to announce the signing of highly rated Middlesbrough frontman Ruman Burrell on loan until the end of the season. The article reads, City complete Burrell loan capture. Bradford City is delighted to announce the loan signing of highly rated Middlesbrough frontman Ruman Burrell. The 20-year-old has agreed a deal which will see him remain at the Utility Energy Stadium until the conclusion of the 2020-21 season. A product of Grimsby Towns Academy, the Birmingham-born prospect made four senior appearances for the Mariners before being snapped up by the Teesside outfit in 2019. Burrell, who made his Borough debut away at Brentford in the FA Cup over the weekend, so obviously the weekend just gone when we went to play Crawley, he said, I am very excited to be here and cannot wait to get started i have a lot of experience in the under 23s but i'm desperate to play first team football and be a part of bradford city so i feel i have made the right decision this is my first law move and will be a challenge but i feel i am ready and looking forward to hopefully scoring some goals interim bantams boss matt truman said our attack is one of the areas we knew we needed to strengthen and ruman's arrival is the first of hopefully a few more to come this window he is fast and direct with an eye for goal which are all the things we are desperate to bring to this side connor and i have been monitoring him since our days in youth football and are confident in his ability to compete at this level. We look forward to seeing him in action at Valley Parade. Burrell will wear the number 19 shirt in Claret and Amber. He's signing his subject for the relevant EFL and FA clearances. Obviously, we'll be coming with him coming from another team. Middlesbrough tweeted, you know, that uh, good luck to Ruman Burrell, all that sort of stuff. And their article reads, which is actually, you know, a pretty long one to say it's a youngster going out on loan who's not really played much first team football. The article reads, Ruman Burrell joins Bradford City in loan deal. Striker Ruman Burrell has joined League Two side Bradford City on loan until the end of the season. Striker Ruman Burrell has joined League Two side Bradford City on loan until the end of the season. The 20 year old was rewarded for his progress in our under 23s when he was handed his senior debut as a late substitute at Brentford in the FA Cup last weekend. Burrell has scored four goals in 11 appearances for our under 23s this term, including a brace in a 5 0 demolition of Sunderland back in October. Now, he is. Well, he has mainly played as that number nine sort of role for the other 23s. You know, he's not one of them forwards who can play out on the wing like what Austin Samuels did every now and then. You know, he is a straight number nine sort of lean Novak sort of player who will play up front. So it'll be interesting to see if... I don't think he'll drop Novak, but, you know, how does Burrell fit into this side if he is the number nine? And Novak's obviously in some great form at the moment. It's going to be interesting to see how all that sort of stuff pans out, you know, because it, if we're only playing with one striker in the 4 2 3 1 formation, how do you get a player that's highly rated in Ruman Burrell into a side where we've only got one striker and Lee Novak is in the form of his life at the moment? The player has previous senior experience with Grimsby Town, having made four substitute appearances for the Mariners in 2018 19 before joining Borough the following summer. Ruman joins a Bradford City side who currently sit four points above the relegation zone in League Two. Did you, did you really need to add that in, Middlesbrough? Did you, did you really need to add that part in? Yes, we're, we're struggling this season, but under Truman and Sellers, we're undefeated. You know, we picked up, like, 11 points from 15. You know, under our joint interim partnership of Truman and Sellers, we're actually doing really well at the moment, but it's a signing that... Not many Braffa fans know about, you know, we, obviously when it gets announced on Twitter, Braffa fans obviously would go over to Middlesbrough and asking their fans, you know, what's he like? And Middlesbrough fans just don't know, they've not seen enough of him, barely seen anything of him, so they can't really comment. But, you know, it's his first low move, I do believe, you know, but it's his chance now to prove that he can do it at League Two level. And it's his chance to prove that, 
you know, he can score some goals, which is what we need because Samuels, Guthrie, he's got one goal between them in the time that they were both here. And that was, you know, Samuels' his only goal was against Tunbridge Angels in the FA Cup and they're like three or four leagues below us. So I'm glad that we've replaced them too. And obviously Truman and Sellers, I think it was them too. Some, well, basically somebody said that's not the only business that we're going to do in terms of a striker. We're definitely looking for one more striker, which I think is a bit bit questionable you know I, I assume that we're probably going to change the system at some point you know you, you'd always need to have that backup plan but you know that would then leave us with four strikers we've got three at the moment in Donaldson, Burrell and Novak all them playing in a one striker formation Donaldson in my opinion I think this will be his last season in football I think he will probably retire at the end of the season so you can't just you know can't just get rid of him you know because he's a Bradford born lad you know he wants to be here all that sort of stuff so I think Donaldson will retire at the end of the season Burrell's obviously only on loan Novak is in the form of his life but his contract is up at the end of the season so it will be interesting to see you know who the striker is that we do bring in this another strike you know what type of striker is going to be I don't sus suspect it will be a target man you know we've just got got rid of Guffrey for that reason so will it be a pacey striker will it be a poacher it really just just depends and I'm you know quite excited to see who it's going to be because a signing like this when we didn't have you know the Turnbull and the way that our window's gone so far I think a lot of Bradford fans would have been a bit skeptical and I think some still are which is understandable you know with a youngster coming on loan you know they either seem to do really well or you know seem to absolutely flop there's never really an in-between with a youngster coming on loan from a team much higher up so it'll be interesting to see how Ruman does but welcome to the club I wish you all the best but yeah guys that is where I am going to leave today's video if you have enjoyed a like would be massively massively appreciated let's try and go for 40 likes on today's video make sure to get your thoughts in down in the comments below what are your thoughts on the signing of Ruman Borrell on a season long loan from Middlesbrough get all your thoughts in that sort of stuff down in the comments below subscribe if you are new we are trying to hit 5,000 before the end of the season as I said at the start of the video if you did check out my reaction to Austin Samuels and Curtis Guffrey both depart in the club make sure you go check them out as I said I do understand that I did upload them during when football was on you know during the Liverpool United game and during when all the football was played on Saturday so I do understand if you guys did miss them videos so make sure you go check them out if you haven't already follow me on Twitch link is down in the description I'm streaming like three or four hours a day over there pro clubs GTA races foot champs all that sort of stuff so make sure you come in over there and tune in subscribe to my second channel down in the description for any gaming highlights foot champs rewards icon roulettes all that sort of stuff enough of the self-promotion my twitter's also down there as well I will see you all tomorrow for the Matty Folds signing peace <laughs>